Greetings folks, it's Skiz Fernando. Welcome back to another edition of Pan Asian. And as the hot weather continues, so too are we going to stick to salads. And today we're going to take a little trip to Japan and make this dish that's called the Japanese Salmon Noodle Salad. As you know, Japanese food is usually very healthy, and this dish is also very quick and easy to make. It also tastes delicious. There's a few new Japanese ingredients that we're going to use, but I'm going to show you how it's all put together in just a second. All right, so follow me. Let's do this. To make this dish, you will need a half teaspoon of wasabi paste a third of a cup of Japanese soy sauce, five tablespoons of mirin, which is a sweet Japanese cooking wine made of rice, and one teaspoon of sugar. These first four ingredients are gonna make the dressing for the salad. You're also gonna need a half pound of dried somen noodles, which is a type of Japanese pasta one teaspoon of sesame oil, one teaspoon of sancho powder, which is a type of Japanese pepper, one tablespoon of vegetable oil, a quarter teaspoon of salt, three salmon fillets weighing about a pound with the skin removed, three spring onions finely sliced on the diagonal, half a cup of fresh coriander leaves, chopped. And finally, one Lebanese cucumber, halved lengthwise and thinly sliced. All right, you ready to get cracking? Let's work on the dressing first. We're just gonna start off with the mirin here. And we are gonna add the wasabi, the soy sauce, and the sugar and just whisk that together to make sure all the ingredients are incorporated. Okay, the next thing we're gonna do is cook the noodles. So we'll go over here to the stove where I have a pot of boiling water. We're just gonna add a little salt to that before we put in our noodles. So we're gonna put one bunch, two, and three. Just gonna really cook these for about two minutes. They cook pretty quickly, the wheat noodles. So we'll just separate them so they don't stick to each other and let them cook for a couple minutes. Okay, next we're gonna take them off the heat and just drain them and run some cold water. And just make sure you get all the water out and drain them well. And now we can remove the noodles to a bowl and toss it with the sesame oil. And the sesame oil is gonna make sure that the noodles don't stick to each other, as well as giving a nice flavor. Because this is gonna be the base of our salad here. And now it's time to deal with the salmon. Okay, we're gonna take the oil Sancho powder, 
and the salt. Combine it all together. And we're just gonna brush this onto the salmon fillets, like so. We'll do both sides, but I'm just gonna do this side first, which is the first side that we'll cook. Just like that. Now we can step over to the stove top and cook our salmon. And even though the salmon is oiled, I'm just gonna add a little oil to the pan for good measure. Swirl it around. And basically, you wanna just cook your salmon maybe for two, three minutes aside. Putting the oil side down. And while that side is cooking, I'm going to take my, the rest of my Sancho oil and salt mixture and just baste, baste. the surface side of the salmon. And like I said, you just have to cook the salmon to your particular liking. Some people like it a little rare in the middle. Some people like it well done. I tend to like it a little on the rare side. So I'm gonna flip those right now. And this is really almost done. So we're talking, you know, only a few minutes of cooking time for this dish. Okay, that's done. And right to my waiting bowl of noodles. And I'm just gonna add the pieces of salmon. And it doesn't matter if it's messy because I'm going to flake it apart anyway. It's going to break those into little smaller flakes on top of the noodle. And let's see, I'm also going to add the spring onions. cilantro, the cucumber, and about half of the dressing. And I'm just going to toss that all together. What you've got here is kind of like a cold Japanese pasta salad, perfect for the summer. 
as you can see there's minimal cooking involved just to basically heat up that salmon everything else is fresh and there you have it folks Japanese salmon and noodle salad on Pan Asian I've got some plated here, it really looks amazing. Here's some of that leftover dressing. I'm just gonna add a little bit to the plate. Wow, would you look at that? So it's time to try it out. That is good. First you get the taste of the sesame oil. Then a little kick from the wasabi. You've got the crunchy bits of cucumber here and spring onion. Contrast it to the moist noodles and the perfectly cooked salmon. All in all, a very quick, fast, and very healthy, delicious dish. This is Japanese salmon and noodle salad. My name is Skips Fernando and I'll see you next time on Pan Asian.